A very good morning children. Welcome to APSTC. This is your host Ms. Meenal Gupta from Army Public School Terry Kant and today we are going to learn about multi-letter phonograms. Are you all ready? Shall we start? Okay. So whenever I speak any phonogram you have to repeat after me, right? Each and every sentence, each and every sound you have you will be repeating after me. Okay. So let us start. This is or the or of search. This is again or the or of her. Next is or the or of bird. Next or the or of hot. So can you can you see? All the four phonograms have the same sound that is R. Repeat R. Let's repeat. This one is R. The R of good. This is yes, the R of okay. This one is the R of good. And this last, the R of good. Moving on to our next phonogram. Hmm. Now this phonogram has three sounds. It is ed, d, t. Repeat after me. Ed, d. Used in past tense ending. Ed, d, t. Good. Ed, as in fold, did. Ed, as in fold, id. Good. Next. D, d, as in dance, d. Next. Picked. Picked, t, as in pick. Picked. Repeat. Yes. Okay. Find the next one is. The next one is. This. This is E. Double E. Repeat. Yes. E as in tree. As in free. Great. Coming next is this phonogram has three sounds. Repeat after me A, E, I. A, E, I may not be used at the end of English words. Yes. One more time. A, E, I, which may not be used at the end of English words. Fine. Okay. So let's see the first term. A, as in there. Next, E, as in protein. I, as in feisty. Clear? We'll have a look at the next phonogram. This is A I. Repeat A I, which is used only at the end of a base word or before a T. Good. Let's repeat. A I used only at the end of a base word or before a T. Now see here. How does this phonogram make A sound? A eight eight eight. Right? 
another one i i t height right let's move to the next one this phonogram has two sounds u u repeat after me yes u u may be used at the end of english words repeat great now see the example u flu u few okay got it moving on to next this phonogram too has two sounds a e which may be used at the end of english words repeat after me a e which may be used at the end of english words let's see the example a as in they e as in key is it clear okay next we have is n mm. this is two letter n mm, used at the beginning or the end of a base word repeat after me two letter n mm, used at the beginning or the end of a base word great n mm, n mm, as in sign okay remember in this phonogram this g remains silent it has no sound there is only sound of n mm. right okay and the last one is is r again this is two letter n mm, used only at the beginning of a base word right repeat after me this is two letter n mm, used at the beginning of a base word like n mm, ni n mm, no the k remains silent it's and it's only the n making the sound n mm. fine i hope you enjoyed thank you so much